So many WordPress form plugins requiring a paid subscription to access essential features such as file uploads. One plugin stands out as the most feature-rich freeform builder with an easy to use drag and drop interface. Let's get started. First, open your WordPress dashboard. From the left menu, navigate to Plugins, then add new plugin. The form builder we are going to use is called Forminator. Type it into the search field and install the plugin by WPMU Dev. Now, navigate to the left menu and under Forminator, select Forms. Let's create our first form. As you will see, the plugin offers a number of pre-built templates. For this demonstration, let's create a blank form. Enter the name of your form and click on Create. Now let's start building our form. Click on the Insert Fields button to access the various form fields. As you can see, the list of free features is quite broad. Let's first add a name field. The Labels tab is where you assign the field labels for the front end of the form. As you will notice, it's possible to split the fields into multiple fields for prefix, first, middle, and last names. Let's choose first and last. In the Settings tab, the Require section allows you to choose whether the field is optional or not for your users. The pre-populate section allows you to pre-fill a field based on the URL that was clicked on prior to opening the form. I'm going to release an in-depth video on this soon. Repeat the process for each field, following the same format as before. Now let's add the file upload field. Select whether to allow multiple file uploads or not. Each section in the settings tab is well documented, so I won't go into much detail here. Now let's preview the form. You may want to position some of the fields side by side to take up less space on the page. To do this, simply drag the field to the position you desire, and it will slot into its position automatically. Before embedding the form on a page, it's important that you set up the email notifications first so you are notified when someone submits a form entry. Edit the default notification, and under Recipients, enter your email address. Finally, select Publish, and you will be presented with a short code to embed the form with. Copy the code, then open the page where you would like to embed the form. If you are using a block theme, you can embed the code directly into the page builder. For classic themes, this would usually go into the text section of your text editor. And that's it. Be sure to like and subscribe for more quick WordPress tutorials like this one.